What's up, guys? Um, it's X Jose here with a video um, about my iPhone 4S stuck on this recovery mode on the iOS 7 one. You can see the well, the picture is different and the iTunes logo is different. Uh, I had this problem for like a week now. I took it to Apple Store. They told me it was bricked. Basically, what I did before it ha this all happened, uh, I was I had iOS 7 beta 6. I'm not I'm not a developer, so I got it pretty much illegally. Uh, um, sorry. Whenever iOS 7 GM came out for developers, I tried installing one that I downloaded from this website. Uh, I did the whole whenever you go to iTunes. Here, wait a sec. And you can iTunes the whole alt alt and then hold alt and then click restore on a Windows computer and uh, I clicked the custom firmware which was the iOS 7 beta GM gold master and it started restoring and then during the middle of that whole process it turned off and gave me an error I came up with an, the error number um, it turned off and then this popped up and then I was like oh because I said failed so I tried restoring it it didn't work gave me an error can't remember what the number of the error was but the fact is it's not restoring I tried going to DFE mode I tried recovering re like restoring it from DFE mode didn't work got an error 21 I tried restoring it from this screen I got an error 1611 um, so apparently my iPhone is bricked. I've seen other videos of people getting their iPhones bricked, but it's as easy for them as just going to DFU, DFU mode and restoring it. But for me, it's not restoring. It's just going back to this screen with a very distorted Apple logo that just keeps rebooting and restarting and restarting and it just won't go away. So here, I will show you what I mean that the, uh, the Apple logo. Okay, so basically I got Red Boot because okay, that's the only that's the only software I know that can kick your uh, your iPhone out of this recovery mode screen. So basically, I click X in recovery mode. My phone will turn off, turn on like it would any normal iPhone will turn on, and it will start to do this. Okay, see, it gets lighter and then it turns off. Reboots. Gets lighter, turns off. And it just pretty much does this the whole entire time. Uh, I don't know what's wrong. I looked at every single video I could find. None of them are working. Not even the whole, the whole turn off. And then as soon as the Apple logo turns on, hold the the volume up button I think that's just for jailbroken phones but mine is not jailbroken um, I did the whole turn it off and then hold your home button and plug it in while holding your home button I did that I did the hold the FU mode I did the recovery screen thing try restoring it pretty much try restoring it from every single screen I could probably get out of this phone and it's not working so far. I took it at Apple Store. I don't know if they said this already, but I took it at Apple Store. Told me $200 to get it replaced. I don't have $200. I need an alt. Uh, at least not right now. Uh, I need an alternate way to get this fixed. If anybody knows of a way to get this fixed or a program to fix this on Windows, on a Windows 8 computer, um, if anybody knows, please leave a comment below. ASAP. I really need to get this phone fixed. I really need my phone. I pretty much can't do anything. I can't communicate with anybody. I need to talk to people that I really need to talk to and I just can't. I don't have a phone. I've been without a phone for a week. Um, as you can see, it's still doing it. Just wait for it. it. Gets lighter. Turns off. Uh, I was expecting iOS 7 now that it's fully released to f be able to fix this problem, 
but it did. It just gave me a 40-13 error that apparently is a new error that pretty much doesn't have a a solution right now, at least from a couple posts I've seen. Um, I really, really need help on restoring this phone. I, I really need to know if I need to take this somewhere. Do I have to take this to somewhere to fix? Is this something that is? Is this something that's wrong with the hardware? Is this something with the software? I don't know. Um, I did drop my phone. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Uh, you can see the cracks right there. Yeah, right there. I know that has nothing to do with this phone doing this because I've seen people with literally chunks of their screen missing. Pretty much seeing the entire inside of their phone. And that has nothing to do with what's happening. At least I hope not. Uh, like I said, I did take it to Apple. They, she, the lady that attended, uh, talked to me there. Well, the first person that looked at my phone said, "Oh, let's try restoring it here." So I was expecting them to actually be able to solve this problem at their um, store. And uh, nope, she came back, said, "No, your iPhone, your iPhone was break because you installed iOS 7." So I was like, "Bummer." And she was like, it looks like you're going to have to get it replaced. She didn't really specify that I have to pay $200. She just said, it looks like it's going to have to be replaced. Me, like a happy person, I thought, oh, I'm getting a new phone. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Uh, I still have a one-year warranty on this. And the, the Apple warranty. And um, I got it replaced. This is my replaced phone from a while back. My other phone. I can't remember what happened to my other phone, actually. Oh, it kept crashing. My other phone kept crashing, and I had to get it replaced. And this one, I don't know why, but it's breaked. That's a software problem, I guess. But I guess since I installed an iOS 7 beta that I wasn't supposed to, especially for people that are not are non-developers, break my phone, and now I'm stuck with a phone that just keeps rebooting, starting, rebooting, starting, rebooting. Um, and I'll show you what it does actually. Whenever I try uh, restoring it through iTunes, because that's the only way I can restore it. Let me actually put it in the iffy mode. Oh my god, I messed up. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. God damn it, I keep messing up, sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So it is now in DFU mode. Uh, like it says, I turn as a text in the iPhone in recovery mode. You must restore this iPhone before you can use what I see. So, go to restore. Restore. Yes, I want everything deleted. Honestly, I do. At this point, I really don't care. So, it pretty much does what any update would do. Restore. And, uh, let that run. And while that runs, see if you recover, can Okay. Uh, so it's extracting software. Phone is in the FE mode. Okay. Prepare an iPhone for restore. Let me get this close so you guys can see what happens whenever I try restoring it. So, there's the Apple logo of it restoring. A little circle, bar turns off.
and that's it. And it just does this items on air void dudes forty thirteen. So if anybody has an idea how to fix this, please, please, please let me know as soon as possible. I really need to get this phone fixed. I really need it. I need to use it. I need my phone. Like anybody else who needs their phone. And if you can, please subscribe, like this video. If anybody knows a way to get this fixed, nothing is working. DFU, iTunes logo, nothing. Nothing is working. Absolutely nothing. Not even the right boot. Um, please, if anybody, this is urgent, please just leave a comment below in the comment section and uh, let me know how to fix this with any program. I don't mind downloading as many programs as I need to download to get this fixed. Uh, I am using a Windows PC, so if it's a Windows program, that would be best. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching and subscribe.